we are on the sleeper train to Donetsk or Donetsk. Donetsk. There you go. Said two different ways. Pretty much everywhere you go in Ukraine, everything is said two ways. So anyway, we're on the sleeper train, and that's Russell's side. And obviously, oh, can you stretch out? Do you fit? Just Close barely. Enough. Probably about six and a half feet. Close enough. Yep. So, uh, this one's fancier than the last one we were on. It's very fancy. Place to hang the coats. We're gonna have to get up. Sure. Yeah. yeah. Russell's reading the candle. There is our window. That was me in the window. And there's my side. There's storage underneath the beds. This right there is our little portable Wi-Fi. It's pretty awesome. It turns 3G into Wi-Fi for us. Pretty cool stuff. It's very awesome, that Wi-Fi on the train. Yeah. We got to FaceTime the kids. Those cookies are incredible. Mm -hmm. Yeah. So, tell us a little bit about this train ride. Well, it just started. So uh -huh. been on the train for less than an hour. It's a 12 hour train ride I think to Donetsk. Yes. Yeah. We started at 8 p.m. and we arrive at 8 a.m. But um, this is a first class cabin for, first of all. So uh, it's pretty nice. It's just the two of us in this cabin. That's what first class means really. And we have extra padding. Mm-hmm. Extra padding. Extra padding. And blankets and comfy pillows and it's pretty cush really. Mm -hmm. So second class would have four bunks, and you can share those with strangers, or you can buy all four bunks. But first class only has two bunks, and third class is just open seating uh, bunks that line the train, and you're just out there with dozens and dozens of people and your stuff. So, so we we we, for first class. we chose first class, <laughs> yes, because it's still not that expensive. So right. So it's, it's much more comfortable than an airplane or uh, even the high-speed trains where you have limited room. Um, the high-speed trains are kind of like sitting on an airplane, um, but they're faster. But why not just stretch out and not pay for a hotel room and get there slowly and sleep on the train. So yeah, first class is not bad at all. Second class and third class I've heard stories about, but when we have this place to ourselves, it's pretty nice. Yeah, and it's about six and a half feet by six and a half feet, but it's yeah. really tall, so you don't feel crammed. No, that's nice. Stretch and then, out, read a book. This is fun. Look, you can see the mirrors and the mirrors and the mirrors. Fun stuff. Rabbit trail. <laughs> you know, it's all good. So, yep, that's what we're doing. We're on the overnight sleeper train, and Russell is reading his book on the Kindle. Get some downtime. All right. That's our train video. <laughs> <laughs> okay, I've run out of things to say. <laughs>